Fear against Akido. Interesting to see if he shows that same bravery against uh, Daigo. Daigo is such a hard guy to read. They're representing Madcats here, he, he, his expression just win, lose, whatever. Always so cool, calm and collective when he is on that that platform. Despite the amount of people we got here, we're close to a full house here. Wow. Looking out there, it's huge inside this venue. This is arguably the biggest, the biggest platform we've ever had. How could Shiro have been on a big stage like this? He wasn't Evo, wasn't he? I remember him beating. True, but certainly not a regular to this. Not as much as Daigo is. So they're getting set up, making sure everything's happy. Everything's so Evil Ryu versus Abel. What is there to know here? It's not your typical, you know, Abel versus Shoto matchup. Of course, Evil Ryu has a bit more to offer, but... How does the ground game go? Because obviously that's very important. We saw uh, Aegon Strider play Daigo. I would oh, say um, the ground the ground game's fairly even, but in terms of risk reward, I really feel like Abel gets a lot more of that ground game. Mm -hmm. It's a very easy button to whiff punish for Abel. Yeah. That crouch medium kick that leads to so much reward for Evil Ryu. If Abel stands in the right range, it's a very easy step kick whiff punish for him, and he gets a ton of damage off that. So you know, Daigo's got to make sure he sticks out at the right ranges. All right, we're in, guys. Straight into it. Madcats, Daigo, Umahara versus Daigo Shiro. Backing off, throwing the fireballs. Trying to maintain that space. What's the start? Shiro gets in. An option select there. Oh, <laughs> that was All right, couldn't finish that off. Maybe couldn't. Look at this, it slowed down all of a sudden after a very explosive start. That step kick, of course, safe if you space it well. Wow, what a meter there. The with TT. And you can see Daigo just backing off, trying to maintain that space all the time. Nice punish. Daigo going oh. for a reset. Oh, did it get two hits though? And a throw, what a sequence from Daigo. I mean, when this guy gets going, he really gets going. Daigo no going answer there from Daigo Shiro. Daigo going for reset, so with Evil Ryu, we don't see that very often. Good call, Logan. I don't think I've seen Daigo do that ever. I saw him try it once in tournament. It didn't work. He never did it again that day. Nice. He's walking into the perfect space to make sure that stand medium. He doesn't whiff. Nice stomach there for the counter hit. Confirm. Oh, drops his link. Shiro smashes it out. Now he has Daigo cornered. Throws him out. Oh, the free frame stand medium, medium punch. punch. Oh, that's a great answer. That is a great answer. Of course, Abel with no free frame normal, only plus one after step kick. If he goes for a fierce, it will be a trade off. Oh, nice whip punish. Again, Daigo takes it. That was absolutely clean, Logan. I could not see a single way in there. <laughs> just, just flawless performance there in that first game from Daigo. Shiro's got to do something different here. I mean, he's got to find a way to open up this brick wall defense. Daigo looking incredibly comfortable with the spacing. Shiro throwing out that light kick. Finding it difficult to get past those fireballs. We saw him dash through one early on in the first round. Nice oh, job. that's one way to deal with it. Jumps out. Stays alive in this, in this round. I think that's important there for Rufa Ryu. Enough damage output to come back from just about anyone in this game. It doesn't get any more intense than this. Oh, base oh, out at reversal. Oh, could have done a better punish, maybe. The full COD would have put him back in wow. the corner as well. Okay. I think it's fair to say Shiro has now arrived in this set. That was a brilliant read there. That, that, that jump over the fireball was really what opened it up for him. And the bait for the Shoryu as well. That stand again, medium, of course, medium three punch, frames. Yep. This is it. The Very clever choice there of application from Daigo. That will beat the TT in case you're wondering why he's doing it. It will lose to stand throw though. Stand throw will beat that. Oh no, I think DC confirm. Shiro's got a meter to do extra damage here. Big drop from Daigo. Wow. That jump medium, I could have sworn was going behind. Nice real kick. Ooh. Nice punish. No meter here. Wake up. Crouch is short. Hit. And he gets a TT afterwards. And Shiro close it out. Oh, he's done it. Beautiful play from Shiro. What a turnaround. And like I said, these guys have been going back and forth for years. If anyone thought this was going to be an easy one for Daigo, they fought wrong. Fantastic adaptation there from Shiro. He ties it up one apiece. Shiro showing his fundamental skills there, his ability to make reads. Let's get it. 
Yeah, every TT here. Really, I don't think there was a single really whiff TT in that. Super advanced tech, just literally just really TPs, jumping fireballs, getting the damage in where it counts. It was so good at doing that. Yeah, that's called himself a daddy. So, you know, he's got that experience. He knows what the little ones are going to do. <laughs> a very rare occasion where... Yeah, blows for the COD. Well, Dago's actually the younger of the two. Oh, how unfortunate. He went for the cross cut, but must have got a double input. Nice bait. Frame trap there. Daigo playing so patiently. She goes in, tries something, doesn't work, gets out of it. Shiro just allowing Shiro to come out of the corner here. And I'm not sure I disagree with this. This is, this is a decent play. You don't want to be in a position to get step kicked. And what he's also done very well is he's not with any of those stand medium kicks that I mentioned at the start. Oh, just as I said, he was right there, but that was too far away to get punished. He's not been using that. Oh, oh, there it is again, Logan. That stand medium punch blinking it instantly as soon as he sees a step kick. But I mean, it wasn't a counter hit there. Was that what did, what did he go for? A TT? I'm not sure. Is he going for a mistimed throw? Of course, you can't blink a throw. If you mistime it, that's that medium will be out. You actually can. It's a roll there from Shiro gets punished. And another reset from Dyke. Oh. He's in trouble. He's in big trouble here. Oh, oh counter hit. Stop the throw from that. Yeah, no hit confirmed. Oh, Dyke already oh, jumped for TT. Oh. What was that? I think that's supposed to be red focus. He's done it! Closes it out though. Daigo. Daigo showing some great tech in that matchup. He's definitely put some work into that. Back to business there after that second game. Just mm. almost an identical performance from that first game. So clean, no answers, no way in, completely safe. And when he hit, he made it count. That was just a, you know, an absolute masterclass performance from Daigo Imahara. Would have been good to see maybe Shiro backing up some of those uh, step kicks with 